Assalamu alaikum, my brothers and sisters. Peace be upon you. Welcome to Minutes to Paradise. Zakat al-Fitr, also known as Fitrana or Sadaqat al-Fitr, is a charitable donation that Muslims must give before the Eid prayer at the end of Ramadan. It is obligatory for every Muslim, regardless of age, who possesses the minimum amount of wealth, nisab, to give this charity to purify oneself and help those in need. The purpose of Zakat al-Fitr is to ensure that the less fortunate can also enjoy the blessings of Eid and have enough to celebrate the occasion. The amount is typically calculated based on the value of staple food items in the region and is equivalent to a specific weight or cost per person in the household. The obligation of Zakat al-Fitr is established through the Sunnah of the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, and is mentioned in several hadiths. One of the most well-known hadiths regarding Zakat al-Fitr is narrated by Ibn Umar, who said, The Messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, enjoined the payment of one sar of dates or one sar of barley as Zakat al-Fitr on every Muslim, young and old, male and female, free and slave, Sahih Bukhari and Muslim. This hadith highlights the universality of Zakat al-Fitr as it is required from every Muslim, regardless of their age or social status. As for the Quranic basis, no specific verse mentions Zakat al-Fitr by name. However, the Quran emphasizes the importance of giving charity and helping those in need. For example, in Surah Al-Insan, Allah says, And they are those who give food in spite of their love for it to the needy, the orphan and the captive, saying, We feed you for the countenance of Allah. We wish not from you reward or gratitude. Quran chapter 76 verses 8 to 9. This verse underscores the selfless nature of charity and the importance of providing for those less fortunate, which aligns with the spirit of Zakat al-Fitr. Overall, Zakat al-Fitr is a form of charity in Islam given before Eid prayer, purifying the fastest shortcomings during Ramadan. It supports the needy, ensuring all can enjoy Eid. The practice fosters community unity, expressing gratitude to Allah and preventing begging. It's a timely local distribution that maintains dignity. It is a vital Islamic practice promoting charity, solidarity, and care for others during festive times.